What's going on, everybody? It is 3.14 p.m. today on a beautiful, what is it, uh, Thursday afternoon. Making this video because I am going to go to work soon in like 15 minutes. And I'm going to have to start driving. And there are a lot of bad drivers out there, you know? I've heard somewhere on the internet that the best way to drive on the road is to pretend that everyone is clinically insane but you. Sometimes I catch myself doom scrolling on Instagram reels and I'm watching these like car accidents happen because either one of the drivers are insanely stupid or both of them are just insanely stupid and it's hard to tell who's at fault. So I sit back and laugh and you know it's funny because it's funny watching stupid people fail right? But at the same time, it could also happen to me one day. And I think everyone has their fair share of stories of driving on the road and seeing something stupid happen. You know, we all have the, uh, we all have the tales of BMW drivers, uh, Kia Soul drivers, New Jersey drivers, uh, New York City drivers. It, it's all pretty, it's pretty bad. I guess you can call them like driving stereotypes. Every time I see one of those vehicles on the road, I either um, yield to them so they can just leave me alone. Or I just hope that nothing happens to me, you know? <laughs> I've seen crazy things where, like, um, they're driving, like, 35 or 40 over the speed limit. They're swerving into uh, different lanes without using their blinkers. Uh, squeezing between gaps that shouldn't be humanly possible. It's like they're asking to create an accident, and then they're probably going to play the victim that it was the other person's fault because they either suck at driving or they failed to yield to them because they are a better driver on the road, supposedly. Another thing I want to talk about is those lifted Dodge Ram drivers, you know, the, the heavy duty, super duty pickup trucks with the, uh, the eight LED beams of light that shine into your eyes like the sun of raw, the beams of light that directly point into your eyeball so it permanently blinds you. I don't understand why they have the need to drive those kind of vehicles. It's like they're trying to compensate for something. Uh, never mind, never mind. We love we love pickup trucks, especially in our area, you know. They they plow the, the snow on the roads. And for my two wheel drive looking ass, I need I need their help because I would not survive on the road during the winter time. If there are any honorable mentions you'd like to mention, please let me know. I would love to read them. Uh or I should say temporarily blind you because you have to get off their line of sight as fast as possible. This is going to be a short one. Uh, I'm going to mention some things from the previous video. I am A-OK. -okay. Uh, do not worry. Life is worth living, alright? I cherish every moment. I also read every single comment from the last video, and I appreciate you guys sharing. It's pretty awesome. I love when I receive human engagement uh, through social media because, you know, I'm a loner. No friends, you know? I'm just kidding with that, too. Hope everyone has a great day, and uh, I'll see you next time. Toodles!